So the running man, uh, this one was one I watched when traveling for work. I don't know, in 2014 or something. So the first time I watched it was a, a pretty low res movie file on my laptop, probably in Ohio or Milwaukee or somewhere. Um, and I loved it. It was a silly, fun, great movie to watch when you're sitting in a hotel kind of bored anyway. Um, I did a rewatch now. I think it was a slightly better file, but still on my laptop. And, you know, it's it's a little, it's a, it's a fun Arnold Schwarzenegger movie. It's a, how about you guys? How'd you watch The Running Man? This time, recently, I watched it uh, first on, uh, I forgot, it was one of the, the streaming services, one of like the, the big three or the big four. Watched it then. It was late night when uh, my kids were asleep, so... I started watching it like on my phone and then I started watching on the TV. You know, it was in like pieces. And then the second time that I watched it was um, from uh, a file that uh, you had shared with me. And both, both were good, but it was like, oh man, this takes me back to, uh, I, I watched it, you know, kind of, I want to say in the, I guess it would have been the 90s, um, soon after it came out or the, the late 90s. Um, and then I also watched it in college, just, you know, one of those, those nights where, you know, a bunch of college buddies are watching cheesy movies. So a couple of times in my life, but most recently, yeah, a uh, couple, you know, through the file you share with me and then on a couple of streaming service or on a streaming service. And it was, it was just as I remembered it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I, I think I've watched this in the nineties, probably with Nick on a VHS. Cause I remember the VHS I, I think it was a, a VHS that wasn't ours. Like we found it. It wasn't official. It was sort of. Oh, I'll it, tell you all about that soon. Okay. Time. Yeah. And then I rewatched it on the on on the computer. Um, and yeah, you know, it's. <laughs> I read the book also. Uh, the you know the one of the Bachman books, the Stephen King Bachman books. Um, and yeah it's you know it's a it's a it's a movie <laughs> you know it, it's on celluloid you can see it <laughs> um yeah it, it's a, i it's kind of i was just fascinated by like the connections between the cast and um and like uh whatever the the, the greater reality of the picture um like the, the bodybuilder guy you know zven the big guy who 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 works for the company as like a security guard um, I found that he has done 15 movies with Arnold Schwarzenegger and is Arnold Schwarzenegger's most common collaborator. And so like little things like that kept popping up when I was trying to look into the movie. And so I, I, I enjoyed that maybe more than the actual picture. <laughs> <laughs> but I do I do remember being at Nick's house as, as a child watching um watching the running man and thinking like it was like oh it was a really badass movie like, this is so dark it's so dark They're, you know this is how they treat criminals in 2017 uh the, the way 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 future um so that was my experience for our loyal listeners out there you may remember this glorious day when i was on my way walking to sixth grade and i came across a treasure trove that i could not believe there were two giant paper um bags full of vhs tapes <laughs> and i decided that i'm going to take both of these to school that day have them in the classroom all day long and then bring home these random sacks of vhs's to see what i had found <laughs> and among those films was the running man now apparently a person must have copied every single thing that was on HBO for a certain period of time. So this is also where I saw The Road Warrior, um, Conan the Barbarian, and a, a variety of other films in that generation, which may be why I enjoy that part of uh, cinematic history so much. Um, I love The Running Man. This is the definition of a guilty pleasure. It doesn't have to be good. It doesn't have to be great. It has to be Arnold. And that's exactly mm -hmm. what it is. It has the most cheese. I think the amount of cheese in this movie is the most you can concentrate within an Arnold film, uh, action film. I think it may have the most cheesy lines within a single movie. But I'll save the rest of that for the episode. I can picture the exact TV that you guys must have watched it on, Nick, in your folks' house. And when I picture that TV, I picture the static because it had an antenna. And so I don't think we were usually watching movies. I didn't realize you had a VCR. But 
I, so when I'm picturing you guys watching The Running Man, it's through a layer of static, which I think might improve the movie. Like it might then add to this this world, this environment of. Uh, <laughs> yeah. I think that it's may like have been because time. it was recorded after off of HBO. <laughs> oh, <that's laughs> <But> <laughs>